just got this package in the mail today. It's uh, motors and a speed controller for my quadcopter. Right now. Comes in its own separate box. Looks like the motor, probably. No, that's going to be the controller. Speed controller. Multi rotor 4 in 1 ESC, it's called. And in here. Just messing around. There's the motors. Come in their own separate little packs. And that's the whole package. I'll start filming again after I get the Emacs package open. Okay, that comes with your uh, I'm assuming these are motor hookups. And there's the Emacs unit itself. Kind of chunky, but probably beats four separate ESCs. Uh, looks like power right there. Okay, that's the whole unit right there. Okay, there's one of the motors. They're brushless, they'll run under water even. Comes with a little accessory pack, the propeller adapter, motor mount, etc. Here I've been laying out the motor mounts. I'm making my own motor mounts. I'm not using the funky ones that they come, they come with the kit. They're too big. They take their excess weight. Um, I have I have some way to mount. If you use these, you got to mount them to something, and then that something has to mount to your copter. Well, I'm just bypassing this, and I'm mounting them more directly to the plate that I made. It's got all the holes pretty much drilled. I got one more that I got to get out of this piece, and I'll be able to do that. But uh, anyway, then I'm going to take it to uh, probably to work and cut it out on a bandsaw. And they're little delta wing shaped things, and they're going to basically they're going to sit out here and they're going to bolt onto the aluminum piece and then the motor is going to sit out at the tip so I'm going to have them in far enough so the motor is sitting right about where the spinning part of the motor is right about there and that's what I'm making for motor mounts so I decided what I'm going to do is cut a big square out of the bottom side of the craft and now I'm talking on the camera. <laughs> I'm going to cut a big square on the bottom of the craft and then I'm going to take the cover off of this. It doesn't really need it. And what I want to do is slide it in in between the two plates and use the mounting bolts to mount it to the top plate. So I'll have a. Uh, it'll be inside, basically. I took the ESC and I mounted it on the bottom side. I cut a hole out of the bottom plate and I actually mounted it right in there. And uh, the wires run out along the legs. Get a couple pieces of zip tie on there and you'll never see the wires hardly. And that's what I ended up doing. 